So much for hopes that the worldwide crisis could be peaking. Global stocks turned negative again Wednesday as traders took in the latest evidence. That included a record death toll the day before in the US and a doubling in new cases in China. Most Asian indexes closed in the red as a result. Hong Kong's Hang Seng fell over 1%. Japan's Nikkei was the exception, gaining over 2%. Markets welcomed Tokyo's decision to declare a state of emergency and step up action against the outbreak. No such positivity in Europe though, where key indexes all fell from the open. The regional stock 600 dropped over 1% in early trade, snapping two days of sharp gains. Shares in Tesco dropped 4% after the UK supermarket said the crisis would cost it over $1 billion. Big UK insurers tumbled too after they scrapped dividends to preserve cash. Aviva was down as much as 9%. Fresh signs of broader economic pain too. Germany's leading economic institute said Wednesday that the country's economy would probably shrink almost 10% in the second quarter. That's more than twice as bad as the early stages of the global financial crisis a decade ago.